Hello, fellow techies and friends. Welcome to ProRer. The sun is an infinite source of energy, for the next 5 billion years, at least, and can be harnessed all over the world. With solar cars the fuel funds that eat up a chunk of everyone's wallets could be saved. Solar panels are also easy to maintain, only requiring occasional cleaning few times a year. With rapid advancements in solar power technology, engineers all over the world have been testing their solar-powered transport innovations on the road, in the sky, and even out at sea. Today, however, thanks to the increased demand for more eco-friendly transport the reality of experiencing solar energy in commercialized vehicles seems closer than ever before. Solar power is a leading option for this mission. Although the technology is weather-dependent, and the solar panels are costly and take up significant amount of space, it has many benefits. Solar cars have mainly been associated with record-breaking speed pursuits and higher educational purposes. A recent flurry of activity in the auto industry around solar-powered cars, however, has momentarily supplanted autonomous technology as the most talked about innovation in the industry, as the once fanciful idea starts to enter the mainstream. Number 6, Apera, Aptera Motors has introduced the first efficient solar electric vehicle that requires no charging whether commuting to work or camping off the grid or for most daily use. Each vehicle can generate enough solar energy for up to about 40 miles of free daily driving and up to 1,000 miles of range when fully charged, shattering industry performance achievements to date. They're doing the impossible, something no other automakers have been brave enough to do. They're harnessing the power of the sun to make life off the grid a reality for everyone. Aptera leverages breakthroughs in lightweight structures, low drag aerodynamics and cooling, material science, and manufacturing processes to deliver the most efficient vehicle ever made available to consumers. Aptera's never charge is built into every vehicle and is designed to harvest enough sunlight to travel over 11,000 miles per year in most regions giving you the freedom to do more with less impact on the planet. It was created from the ground up with one purpose in mind, energy efficiency. Its unique shape allows Aptera to slip through the air using 30% of the energy compared to other electric and hybrid vehicles on the road today. Each Aptera owner can reduce their carbon footprint by over 14,000 pounds of CO2 per year. They're making it easier for you to do your part. Inspired by fighter jets and race cars, Aptera protects you and your loved ones with a safety cell seven times stronger than steel. Aptera is redefining the ways vehicles are designed and built. They've taken a pivotal leap forward with 3D printing, AI, and a composite body allowing for rapid, high volume and cost efficient vehicle production. Number 5, SunSwift Racing. SunSwift Racing is a volunteer student-led organization dedicated to developing a high-performance solar racing vehicle and in doing so provide a context for practical learning and sustainable development. The project embraces the spirit of excellence, innovation, and proactive youth leadership to drive the development of energy-efficient technologies. SunSwift Racing is a team of innovators working to redefine the future of sustainable transport through the research and development of solar electric vehicle technologies. Whilst SunSwift is best known for its success in the World Solar Challenge, they also focus on progressing technology through partnerships and collaborations with industry leaders. Based in Sydney, Australia since 1996, SunSwift has built six solar vehicles, with a seventh currently in production. Over this time, SunSwift has seen success in numerous solar vehicle races and holds records with the FIA and Guinness World Records. According to developers it's world's fastest solar power car over a distance of 500 kilometers. This car captures solar energy through solar cells that are incorporated into its body, in addition it's a first row legal solar sports car. It has a max speed of 140 kilometers per hour and a range of about 800 kilometers all without using a drop of fuel. Number 4, Quantum. The University of Michigan Solar Car Team is an entirely student-run organization that designs, builds, and races world-class solar vehicles. Since its establishment in 1989, it has built 16 vehicles and have competed on the national and international level, earning 17 championships and podium finishes to be America's number one team. The team is made of four different divisions, engineering, 
strategy, operations, and business. The UM team, the biggest and best in the nation, uses a $1.2 million budget to build the fastest sunlight-powered vehicle that can within the competition's restrictions. The 11th vehicle the team built is called the Quantum. It weighs in at just around 320 pounds without a driver, 200 pounds lighter than its predecessor, Infinium. It is 30% more aerodynamic than Infinium and is the best solar car the team has ever raced in the World Solar Challenge. For the first time in the team's history, two chassis were built in one project cycle. This was achieved by completing the first iteration ahead of schedule and under budget. Quantum runs on an in-hub, brushless electric DC motor powered by a lithium-ion battery pack. Regulations allow for 6 square meters of space for the silicon solar cells. The car looks like a table and might only have 12.3 horsepower, but it can jet up to 105 miles per hour. It is made almost entirely from carbon fiber. Quantum was extremely competitive in the World Solar Challenge. Despite some issues that arose during strong crosswinds in the outback, Michigan placed in third once again. After the outstanding performance in Australia, Michigan was eager to bring home a win. They seized the opportunity in the American Solar Challenge by taking a record-breaking fourth consecutive victory and seventh victory overall. Even with severe thunderstorms and triple-digit heat, Quantum finished over 10 hours ahead of second place, breaking the previous record of difference in race time between first and second set by Continuum. Quantum 2.0 returned to race in the 2014 American Solar Challenge, and won its second national championship. Quantum won the inaugural Abu Dhabi Solar Challenge in January of 2015, making it the most successful solar car ever designed, built, and raced by any team ever. Stay tuned till the end and give the video a thumbs up while you also smash the subscription. Number 3, Proof. Cal Poly's Prototype Vehicles Laboratory, Proof Lab is a student-run non-profit organization that strives to solve real-world issues by pushing the boundaries of engineering. The organization was founded by a group of students with the intention to demonstrate the potential of sustainable transportation and ultimately design and manufacture vehicles that break records and gain widespread recognition. The team's flagship project is Dawn, a purely solar-powered car designed to travel faster than 65 miles per hour. The team's current focus is on Miela, a fully electric, long-range sports car that will travel over 1,000 miles on a single charge, breaking the Guinness World Record. It aims to address the issue of range anxiety in the industry by showing the capabilities of electric vehicles. In proof, members gain hands-on experience to prepare them for industry, while learning to work with a team to bring these innovative projects into the world. Number 2, Stella Vita. Stella is the world's first solar-powered family car. It was created and built by a team of 20 students from the Eindhoven University of Technology in 2012. It is a fully working prototype and helps us a step forward to solar mobility. With Stella we can expect a clean future where driving is safe and simple. It showed the world the future of automotive and solar-powered mobility. Stella Vita is a self-sustaining house on wheels. A mobile home wherein you can live and work while traveling on the energy of the sun. It generates energy through its solar panels on the roof and uses this energy for both driving and living. It generates enough solar energy to drive, shower, watch TV, charge your laptop and make coffee. You are completely self-sustaining and independent. Hereby, you are free to go wherever you want, without harming the environment. Stella debuted in the 2013 World Solar Challenge in the Cruiser class and performed so well that Stella became world champion. Next to the challenge in Australia, Stella crossed the globe, from Singapore to California, to show the world that it is possible to drive solely on the power of the sun. The start of a legacy. Number 1, Lightyear 1. Having started from scratch, these sexy renderings from Lightyear 1 is engineered like no other car. This allows you to have a truly convenient and clean journey. Explore the world, independent of the charging infrastructure. With its 5 square meters of solar panels you can drive for months without charging. Comprising solar cells encased in safety glass, the sturdy solar roof and hood live up to rigorous auto industry regulations. 
Lightyear One is a long-range solar electric vehicle designed to be grid independent and to drive anywhere. Its unique vehicle architecture and technology have been developed with high efficiency in mind, allowing Lightyear One to consume only 83 watt-hours per kilometer, two to three times less energy than any other electric vehicle on the market today. This results in an exceptional range of 725 kilometers with the lowest emissions, the lowest charging frequency, and 7,000 to 20,000 kilometers of free, effortless, and clean solar range every year. Lightyear One has four independent and wheel motors providing power when and where it is needed. The motors deliver improved traction control and maximize energy efficiency on all types of surfaces. It is a cruiser, built to go the distance in any environment. Thanks for watching the video. If you like the videos and contents please like, comment and subscribe our channel.